I don't know why people just shoot guns, you know. It's going to hurt somebody. Just shoot them in the air for what? A father shaken, struggling to understand how someone could be so careless during a New Year's celebration. His daughter, a UNC student, is recovering in the hospital after being hit by a bullet during Raleigh's annual New Year's celebration first night. CBS 17's Colleen Quigley was at the Acorn Drop last night. She joins us live from downtown Raleigh. And Colleen, you spoke with a woman's family. This has to be scary and obviously tough. Yeah, I mean, shocking for them, shocking for anybody who was here last night because there were thousands of people here last night packed into this very spot on a night that was supposed to be full of celebration. And instead, 22-year-old Caitlin Kong was here with friends and never expected what would happen to get hit by a bullet. Caitlin Kong's father says it was the UNC student's first time at First Night Raleigh. Her roommate snapped these photos of the 22-year-old enjoying the New Year's Eve celebration downtown. She wanted to see the acorn. Never goes downtown. You know, the one time she goes downtown, you know. Three, two, one. Happy New Year! But shortly after the acorn dropped, sometime during the firework display, between midnight and 12.05 a.m., Caitlin was hit by a bullet from celebratory gunfire. Jeffrey Kong says his daughter couldn't breathe and a roommate rushed her out of the crowd and chaos. Four or five hours of surgery last night. They had to cut her open because it went in, punctured the corner of her lung, went in bottom of her chest there, through her abdomen, through, through uh, her stomach, and they bounced around inside. It's awful. Caitlin's father says she's in a lot of pain and is expected to be in the hospital for several days. The family is shocked that a night that was supposed to be a celebration turned so violent. That's a stupidity. Guns are never designed for, you know, those are lethal weapons. And it could have went to somebody's eye, to the ear, somebody's heart. Somebody's going to get killed someday. I mean, she's lucky, I guess. Yeah, she certainly is lucky. Now, we reached out to the organizers of First Night Raleigh, telling us they're aware of the Raleigh police investigation into the shooting tonight. Raleigh police saying they don't know who fired that gun last night. So here's how you can help if you know anything about this incident. You're asked to give Raleigh police a call. Reporting live in downtown Raleigh, Colleen Quigley, CBS 17 News.